life's such a beautiful thing. Don't you think? We're supporting the locals here in my city today. So big shout out to Little B Hong Kong, or let me read this again. Little B Barbecue Hong Kong Cafe. So on the menu today, we got wonton soup. We got fish ball soup. We got Hong Kong style kanji. We got, let me read this, eggplant minced pork in exo sauce. We got the special Hong Kong fried rice. We got the, I believe this is ho fan. This is the Sweshan style chicken vermicelli. This is uh, rice noodles. And I think the sauce goes on, I think. Oh man, hopefully it does. <laughs> we got the Hong Kong um, French toast and we got the Hong Kong pineapple bun and there should be, I guess there's no butter or I guess it's melted in the middle there, okay? Let's get uh, into Hong this. Kong style food, okay, there's a little like kind of Confusing thing. I ordered a uh, barbecue combo pork, but they didn't have the combo pork But I only found out just now just because uh, I was counting the stuff I wrote down and There's no barbecue pork and she just told me that she did not charge me, but she didn't tell me until I called it <laughs> So a little confusing, but it's okay guys. We'll have barbecue pork next time. All right <laughs> Okay in the menu today Okay, we'll start off uh, da, da, da. Pineapple bun <laughs> so, you guys don't know a pineapple bun? I think they make this in house, but I don't know. Don't quote me on it. <laughs> but it's pretty much a crusted top. It doesn't taste like pineapple. It's supposed to look like a pineapple, but it's supposed to be uh, homemade butter in the middle. But you can see some butter in there. Eh? You see a little resemblance, but bite on this. The bottom part first. Quick tie. Yeah, it's got it. Nice. Super pumped for this Hong Kong style pineapple bun. Mmm. Mmm. Okay. The butter is melted right into it. Mmm. Okay, Hong Kong. I see you. <laughs> Even though they didn't tell me about my barbecue pork until last minute. This Hong Kong bun, or pineapple bun, makes up for it. Mmm. Uh, I had many, many pineapple buns in my lifetime. But I want to say this place makes some really good pineapple bun. Mmm. Mmm. It's soft, it's airy. You bite into it, it's chewy. You get a nice crust on top. It's just beautiful. Yup. Yeah. Hong Kong honeybee. Is it Hong Kong honeybee? Hong Kong. I forgot the name, guys. It's so confusing. <laughs> honey Bee Hong Kong Cafe. No, Honey Barbecue Honey Bee Hong Kong Cafe. Mmm. They're well known for French toast as well. Pretty crazy, right? So, I'm not even sure what's in their French toast. But it looks amazing. We'll pull out the Vietnamese knife. Yeah. You know what? I never had a French toast in so long. And we're gonna try the Hong Kong style French toast. Quick time. And it's got a nice soup pump for this. Wow. That's really good. <laughs> I don't know what they put in the middle. Looks like um egg, egg custard. But it is absolutely amazing. I would say I prefer this style Hong Kong or this style French toast more than the Russian style. It's like a perfect amount of sweetness, perfect amount of savory, perfect amount of everything. Oh man, it's real good. It's real good actually. Mmm, that's real good. Let's try this thing right here. 
not too sure what it's covered with, but I know that these are rice noodles. It smells like a soybean sauce. I don't know, but it smells amazing. Rice rolls, Hong Kong style, quick time. It's gonna be nice, super pumped for this. Mmm. All right, that's real good. <laughs> it's like soy peanut butter. It's like a soy peanut sauce. Soy peanut butter and sesame sauce. Oh man, that's real good. That's real, real good. Another one. Yeah. Oh man. All right, Hong Kong. I see you. Another one. Let's get a quick ah! Soup pump it. Yeah, so good. That's real good. We're gonna try this Sweshan vermicelli this year. That doesn't look like that much, but maybe it packs a punch? I don't know. Is this Sweshan vermicelli? It kinda doesn't look like it. Every time I think about Sweshan, anything Sweshan, I gotta see peppers. There's eggplants in this. Okay, let's get some. All right, let's do this. Sweshan vermicelli, quick time. It's got it, nice. Soup pump this. It's nice, but it's just too simple to be a dish. Next, we got this. I believe this is called Ho Fan. So it's rice noodles, thicker rice and noodles with nice beef. Oh man. Let's do this. Bite on this. Quick tap. Let's get it. Nice. So pop this. Very good. I love these kind of salad noodles. They're nice, thick, soft. And they just melt in your mouth when you eat them. Like that. Here we go. Special fried rice from the restaurant. Looks good. Looks like there's char siu, some egg, and that's all I see. <laughs> Open your mouth. Let me slide this rice in. It's got it. Nice. Soup off this. Mmm. It's good. Not the best fried rice, but it's tasty. Oh. Eggplant and pork in exo sauce. Looks amazing. For sure you gotta eat it with the rice, but let's try it by itself first. Mm -hmm. Bite on this. Quick tap. It's got it. Soup pump for this. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's good. <laughs> it is pretty tasty, guys. Fish ball soup. Not too sure what this is. Seaweed? That surprise right here. Never knew they had rice noodles. That was just wonton noodles. A little broth, quick tap. This guy, nice. Soup off this. A little blend. Ah, it's a light, it's a light broth, guys. Noodles, quick tap. This guy, nice. Soup off this. Mmm. 
little fish ball. Wonton noodles with the noodles first. Quick time. It's got a nice soup on for this. Mmm, rough. Mmm, dumpling. Mmm, dumpling is really good. Lastly, Hong Kong style kanji. I was always a kanji guy growing up. Oh man. What is this? I don't even know what that is. We're gonna put it in. Hopefully it's a thousand year old egg. Ever had a kanji with a thousand year old egg? Oh man, pieces of meat in there. I think that's what makes kanji good. You know? Kanji with a thousand year old egg is the best thing ever, guys. Quick time, kanji. Soup off this. Oh, that's nice. That's real good. Mmm. -hmm. Whoever thought peanuts in kanji would be tasty. That's real tasty.